Good morning, guys. Welcome to a new vlog. Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate it. Um, today, well, first off, I started the morning kind of getting like all my videos organized and like what I want to film, plan, everything. Uh, but this is like a good little peek at what I am going to be doing, like how I kind of like lay stuff out. So this is kind of like the look of or a little peek into the 14th of the week of the 14th so i have a vlog from today going up on the 15th an adoption video um which it's funny because like i'm going to post like why i don't do a lot of adoption videos but i do have one video idea left kind of so and um then i have my 5 a.m morning routine and then i just have a vlog today to make sure like i remember to vlog I just like to have this as like a template or skeleton so I have like some sort of plan. I actually have stuff there so I can't really show that part but I have like um, why I don't film adoption videos. I have like a little checklist like what I need to film. Then I just have my 1 p.m. meeting like reminder even though I like never look at this really for work anymore. Um, I used to but now I don't because I don't have like a lot to jot down but then I have like a vlog um, three, five going up. And then I have like film morning routine, like my 5 a.m. morning routine. And then I have like my what's in my purse video. Right now I have a blank canvas and I'm going to import footage and get to editing um, because I just need to edit yesterday's vlog, then my purse video. Then if I have time, I will just edit um, one of the adoption videos. So yeah, it's like a race. Also, I have a little bit more laundry going over there, so um, I'm gonna do that. Sherry! Hello. Tell them what we're doing today while well, Sherry's working. I'm working, but I'm starting in half an hour, so I'm trying to get some dishes out of the dishwasher. And we gotta keep away, this house all, running somehow. All the laundry Alex's does put away, so. Oh my gosh, it's crazy. It is. There's a lot to do. And then later tonight we're going to Disney Springs. Yes, that'll be fun. Yeah. So. We dinner. Get some, get some fresh air. A little exercise. Yep. Get out and walk a bit. Mm. I'll be I was telling my parents I wanted to get out and enjoy this nice weather because it's going to get really, really hot here in, in the summer. And I just want to like take in the nice warm weather. So that's why I just like got inspired that we need to go to Disney Springs and like hang out and enjoy weather that is the game plan today so this is my outfit for disney springs today we're just going for a few hours just to hang out um so it's my like casual look um i have my align tank on and then the biker shorts here and then my white tennis shoes along with just like these ears I haven't actually officially worn the mint green one, so I just decided to whip these out and wear them today. Valerie's outfit. Yep, I'm decked out in my Disney shirt. And our goal tonight is to try to find the mini backpack that matches that backpack. And I hope we find it too. I know. I can't wait. Yeah. Okay, sorry the lighting's kind of crazy. Okay, now it's not, it's cool now. But I am taking some footage on my phone for a like TikTok I'm probably gonna put together. I don't know what it's going to be. It's probably gonna be like one of those montage ones because they seem to get a lot of views. So I figured out a way that I could like double up the footage so I can use it for YouTube as well. Valerie's trying no, to get I'm trying over. To see. I'm, yeah, I'm trying to see, I can't see over your camera. Oh, sorry. Okay. Sorry, Mallory. Thank you. Anyway, <laughs> but I am... Just trying to drive, you know, big old camera in the way. Hey, it's not that big. <laughs> All right. Well, your camera's big. It's bigger than any camera I ever owned. That's true. It is called a mirrorless, <laughs> not a DSLR. Anyway, I am going to double up on footage because when I'm shooting um, vertically, or I should say portrait, um, I'm shooting in 4K, so the resolution's really good, and then the frame rate is like 60 frames per second, so the frame rate has really nothing to do with it, but I'm shooting in 4K so I can like zoom in and make it like a rectangle, like for landscape view. So I figured out a good way and I'm happy because it's so hard to like double film for like cool montages when like I wanna do TikToks as well because I feel like 
I just need to get on the TikTok bandwagon. So what what's the frame rate then? What what's why is that not relevant to what you're saying? Because frame rate is like like how many frames per second a a object is moving. So a slower frame rate would be like the camera's not picking up a lot not a lot but like it's not capturing so much of your movement but at a higher frame rate like you can so a higher that. frame rate you have more detail it's more it's more like saying? motion it's okay. more like motion and then um 4k versus like the resolution is how many pixels okay. are being captured in the screen so when you zoom in it'll be less pixelated got it but if it's a smaller version like 720 it's going to be pretty pixelated like it's going to be blurry so is this like a frame rate you said per second do you mean per second or per minute what is frame rate? frames per second frames per second okay i knew what pixels were yeah i did i did because i have been alive in the digital age for a while Ooh. oh excitement yes <gasps> at disney oh my god there goes a oh my star. gosh, Valerie, you need to tell them. What do we see on the way here? It was on the road. Oh my God, we saw a baby carrier. I slowed down to make sure there wasn't a baby in it. <laughs> I know. Man, that was scary. Yeah, Valerie like literally stopped and she's like, what in the world is that? It's like a baby carrier yeah. on the side of the road. Yeah. I bet there was a baby in it. Oh my I goodness. I bet somebody took the baby. Oh my goodness. No, I bet somebody rescued the baby. I bet somebody put the baby carrier I hope so. With the baby. But, but why would a baby, maybe it was just on a junk truck and it fell out. Let's just hope that. Maybe I hope, I hope, so. hope there wasn't a baby in that. Well, if somebody abandoned their baby in the baby carrier... Why would they abandon it on a highway? Like, in the middle of... Well, I, that, that would be kind of stupid with cars going 55 miles an hour. Yeah, that's true. It, also dangerous. Yeah. Not a whole lot of care for the baby. No. I hope there wasn't a baby in it. I know. But if there were... If there was a baby in it... I was going to say if there were babies in it, but I don't think that was big enough for more than one baby. If there was a baby in it... Then the baby was gone, so I would assume someone that got someone the baby. has taken the baby to the authorities. Right. I would hope that you know. Yeah. I hope there weren't a baby though. I know. Man, that was weird. It was. Nobody told me to settle. We're in line at Starbucks. We are. Well, we're waiting for our drink. All right, so Valerie and I got Starbucks. She got her black tea. I did. And for some reason, I was craving my original, like, go-to drink, which is just a grande iced chai tea latte with two pumps of vanilla. This is just what I used to always get, and I was craving it. So I'm going to just enjoy this. This line is so freaking long. There's whole crowd. It's so crowded here, so we don't know if we're going to be eating here. <laughs> Valerie, say it again. Goofy's Candy Company, there's dinner. Yep. That's what it's going to boil down to if we can't get into the Rainforest Cafe bar. Sherry made it. I don't know if I included her in the vlog. She's a little hangry right now. <laughs> she gets angry when she's not fed on that time. That's true. It's been more than four hours since I've been fed. <laughs> I need to eat. Anyway, we're going to try to get into the Rainforest Cafe bar. Okay, so everything's a really, really long wait, so we gave up on that. I think we're going to go to the Disney store now to see if we can find Valerie's mini backpack. Hopefully, fingers crossed, it'll be there. I mean, it's a very big store. On a less busy night, on a less busy night, we're going to come back. Yeah. Right, Sherry? about you something about you I like the Disney 50th about spirit jersey kind of cool crazy for saying I should slow down but maybe I'm escaping the love we found we found it we found oh, it look it's a backpack for my backpack all right uh I, I need to have one that's 
Okay, so now we're going to just go to Cooks of Dublin, I think, because we're just gonna hope that the line isn't that long and see what we can get. I know. Yeah, we're just looking at uh, the paddle fish over here. Hopefully we can get in at Cooks of Dublin and like the line won't be too, too long, even though you never know, because it's super, super crowded here tonight. <laughs> All right, so Sherry, where are we? It looks like they're just doing like every other table seating. So we are at Boathouse. Yeah. Well, we're not at Boathouse. Paddlefish, another boat restaurant. Yeah, oh my gosh, I keep getting it confused. But we're gonna see if we can eat here, like get appetizers. sit down at a table like a person. So we're gonna see if there's any bar stools. If not, then we're going to cook some Dublin. Sherry's thrilled, as you can tell. Oh, I think this would be a great option. Yes. Say it again. I care what they have to eat, it doesn't matter. I said, I don't care what they have to eat, it doesn't matter at this yeah. point. Oh, we're opening. Okay, so Valerie is gonna stand. Sherry is gonna have this seat, and then I'm on this like tiny seat. It's cool, like we're chill vibes here. It's a little low, but it's fine. Hopefully we'll get something good. Okay, update. We're going to cook some stuff. We may end up at Goofy's Candy Store before it's over. When at I'm not, it's too far to walk back. That's <laughs> true. I will not. We'll see. I love, you, you guys love our adventures, so. Let's go on this one. Right, Valerie? Right. All right, guys. It is almost 8.30 and we made it to dinner. Okay, here we go. We got all of us got fish and chips. Okay. That's what we landed on. Okay, so we're driving home from Disney Springs. It was fun. We finally got our food, but I wanted to come on and tell you guys because we were seeing some fireworks as we were driving home. Um, when we used to live in Celebration, we always could hear the fireworks and it would always be nine o'clock because we would hear the um, Epcot Wishes no. show. Not wishes. Um, was it Magic Kingdom? No, we would hear Epcot Illuminations. Oh, w Illuminations. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, got the no, shows okay. mixed up. No, it's all right. But yeah, Illuminations, Reflections of Earth. Yes. <laughs> so it would always happen at nine o'clock. And I was saying to Valerie that that's how I knew when to get in the shower when I was a kid, like doing my homework <laughs> and stuff. I'll be like, oh, that's my cue. I need to get in the shower. Yes, and I was saying to Alex that back in the days when they used to do illuminations and at Christmas time, they would do Let There Be Peace on Earth. Yeah. And it was very nice and it was very, very loud. And it always sounded like we were being attacked. Yeah. You know, that when it sounded like they were firing at us. Yeah. Because the Let There Be Peace on Earth fireworks were like so, so loud. They were. <laughs> so we're just going down memory lane. <laughs> 